to make this recipe, you'll need a pepper, you'll need a salmon, you'll need some carrots, and then some radishes. Take your salmon out of the package and start to cut it. Then get your salt and just sprinkle that on the salmon. My mom buys pink Himalayan salt because we we're we're fancy. Then <laughs> that's about it. Yeah. Then grab your pepper and just sprinkle that all over the salmon. Wow. Take your pan and then proceed to make the pan hot. Then, what you'll probably do is take your cold butter and put it on your hot pan. Then, take your hot pan with melted butter on it and add on your salmon. Wow, that is one sizzle, am I right? Then, take your radish and cut it. Then cut it again. Then cut it again. Oh yeah. Then, add the radishes. This is my bird Gandhi, isn't he cute? Where did the turnip go for a few drinks? The salad bar! Then, grab a lemon, and cut it into four nice pieces. While your food is cooking and you cut your lemon, spray some lemon juice into the salmon to give it the flavor of lemon. <laughs> Many people like pouring coriander in their salmon. Those people are clinically insane. Right now, your salmon is just about done, so get ready and put it on a plate. Once you have it on a plate, throw in some carrots. Then, get a pepper. Cut your pepper. As shown, that's how you cut a pepper. Cook half of your pepper. Put your pepper on the plate. 